Hey, what's up everybody? This is the Asian Video Gamer here today. Uh, coming to you with a session of Dark Souls 2 PvE. Today I'm just going to be showing how to how I farm in the Shaded Woods and uh, how to farm for these Lion Warrior armor set. These guys don't give a lot of souls so this is not really a good place to farm for souls but I realized that you know like they're their armor set looks pretty decent or maybe not I don't know but they're really really rare to drop so I just really wanted to farm them the first time I came here these guys were really total assholes and I didn't know like what what these guys were about and as soon as I walked up here like as you can see the three of them came at me and I, I died but now after realizing uh, like what what to do like I can breeze through this area really easy and those of you who are looking for all the item places and stuff like that well if you follow this guy you can kill all the uh, lion guys and then it'll be pretty easy for you to walk around and grab all the treasures um, know that there is a big basilisk when when you come up this ramp but uh, you can kill it with range or whatever or just get some poison throwing it and just poison it to death. It's very easy to kill. The basilisk won't come at you. And these guys, um, I realized like you, you can't really strike behind these guys when they attack. You gotta wait for the timing and roll behind them and do a backstab. And out of all the enemies I've seen so far, these guys are really easy to do a backstab on. And it's very satisfying because these guys are super assholes. Like I said before, these guys are really, really bad because like they, their their acts are really damaging. They do tons of damage. Like two hits on this character is death. Not to mention they curse you. So basically, every time I get hit, I get healed, and then I get hit again. I get cursed and my overall life is dropped and then they they two shot me which is insane but now after like I realize what I can do um, like how, how to pull these guys and how to do all the backstabs and roll away these guys are really easy and you'll see that this farming group that I'm doing it's less than five minutes and I kill I think at least ten of them and one of them is a special one, which you'll see uh, soon. So right off the bat, I already cleared like more than half of them already, and it's just in the same area, like just outside the uh, bonfire. So this area isn't actually that big in terms of size, but it's really dense. And be careful if you're running around; it, you'll trigger. Like these guys have a huge aggro range, so you don't want to walk around aimlessly. Another thing to note is that I unpetrified uh, pe a lot of, uh, I think all of them, all three of them. Uh, I could be wrong, there might be more, but I I used the uh, fragment branch of Yor and uh, freed, up, free, freed up the entire space here. So I can actually uh, just run through the entire place and grab, and I think I grabbed everything in here. So coming up is this uh, special golden lion he actually drops a rare chest different from the other ones and uh, I don't know what the drop rate is but apparently they're, they're all really rare and that's unfortunate because I really want to collect all the armor set if I can this guy used to be petrified I petrified him so yeah and this guy should be the last guy yeah and he was no no challenge at all. So coming up, um, this is the spe area after you use the branch. Here's the thing, a basilisk. Damn thing, the only thing that hurt me this entire run. Oh well. Well, that's it for this run. If you run, uh, be careful of this space. I died once here by accident without jumping. But yeah, you, you have to make jumps here and then you're, you're back here. To the, to the shortcut to the bonfire. So yeah, enjoy. I hope you guys uh, enjoy this video. Toodles.